Hello, Namaste and welcome in the series of cyber security. This side is Meena and today I will discuss about how to become a cryptographer. Cryptographer means a person who can hide something that's written and uh, having a knowledge of lot of things to just encrypt the data to understand it and to secure the data of company or the organization okay so first of all we need to understand what is cryptography and uh, what things you need to become a crypto cryptographer okay as you can see in pitch in this picture cryptography is just uh, there are two words crypto plus graphic crypto means we are hiding something and graphing means how to write it okay so whatever the information that is valuable for us and we don't want to share to the unauthorized person that means we want to hide it so whatever the methods we are using to hide it that means we are using cryptography okay either we are placing the words order or we are using uh, another uh, keywords to replace the values okay or we are using some extra keys to uh, make those values uh, 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 in uh, just convert in a way so that it cannot make any sense to the other normal reader okay so cryptography here are you can see there are a lot of things about uh, in in the scheme of the cryptography you you must have uh, the inclination towards solving the problems okay uh, even you have seen so many movies uh, over there uh, some hidden messages uh, in a scroll and uh, they were just trying to decode it uh, there was uh, uh, some uh, uh, something was written on it that's having some sense so so they need to find out what the meaning of that they will just go here and there and then find out one clue and then they will point it to the next clue and then a lot many things they need to decrypt to just read that particular message okay similar way just you have you must have the inclinations of uh, solving the problem you must understand how the cryptography work what are the, the algorithms used how that works what will be the symmetric asymmetric keys what is the digitalization of the cri cryptography okay digital keys we can say uh, and uh, what are the ciphers plain text how to convert into the encrypted format what will be the suitable for your uh, organization okay optimum use of it we cannot use the short method or the short keys to encrypt our data because uh, if you will use short keys to encrypt it, it will be easy for the hackers to decrypt it okay and if you will use too long keys to decrypt uh, to encrypt the data means it will put a lot of pressure on your uh, devices to because uh, big problem to solve computer need big big this uh, processing ram and other things as well clear so uh, multiple things you need to uh, know to become a cryptographer okay so what are, what can be the uh, responsibility for the, the cryptographer first of all they need to understand what is cipher what is algorithm and the security system how does that's work okay and uh, how to just protect the data and how to uh, use your defensive uh, mechanism to code the data so that uh, you will just create challenge for the hackers okay uh, so that they will not be able to decrypt it because you have the responsibility to protect the financial data okay or something very very important maybe that's uh, you you will be deputed in a government sectors or some uh, another, another sectors where the, the data is very very critical okay so you have the responsible responsibility for it okay how to guard against any kind of attack or the, any kind of, of revelation and uh, uh, how to defend against editing copying or deleting first of all they should not uh, hacker should not get the copy of it or edit it over or delete it. okay so what methods you will use you will come to know yes something happened to our data and how to secure it okay and you must be good in mathematical problem solving in the statical data code you also need to understand the security guys uh, i i hope you uh, realize this 
in the in the field of cyber security everywhere you should know about your enemy you should know about the hackers you should know the, about their mindset what tools they are using it's the foundation of uh, just beginning of uh, the cyber security until unless you will not able to understand the attacks mentality of the hackers you would not able to protect your data whether you are be a uh, cryptographer or the security uh, analyst uh, or uh, whatsoever you will be you will don't know to be able to understand first of all you need to understand where is enemy exist how that works then you will be able to protect your uh, networks okay and so you must have the knowledge of the vulnerability how to test it so that you just come to know is there any kind of uh, vulnerability exist in my security systems whatever i am using to uh, for the cryptography okay or if any kind of problems you comes that's related to the security how to solve it in the in the shortest time period okay and uh, you need to uh, in the research mode always what uh, uh, kind of attacks are happening nowadays uh, uh, maybe just you have heard quantum computing even they can they are saying uh, with biggest or the strongest uh, security protocols with the cryptography protocols we are using they can also decrypt it okay so you you always in the hunt whatever systems i am using for my organization whether that's uh, uh, is uh, uh, capable to secure the data okay and what skills you need understanding of any programming language that can be c c plus plus java or python okay or mathematics solving problem algebra and understanding the complexity of the algorithm because whatever the um, algorithms we are using algorithms uh, certain kind of methods if you'll do this one then this one then do this one then do this one okay so you must understand how that uh, how the secure uh, how the algorithms use whether that's a uh, sha uh, uh, md5 or the uh, uh, advanced encryption standards or so what whatever the advanced uh, algorithms we are using you 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 must understand it what those will do and how how that will be able to protect our data okay information theory number theory you must understand digital signatures okay encryptions key exchange because uh, just no, not only encrypting the data will solve the problem how uh, to solve that problem you need a complete method okay pki public infrastructure okay. that is having all the from the key to generate the key to secure the keys to encryption methods how to delete where to place each and everything you must have knowledge of the like symmetric key the same key you are using to encrypt the data and decrypt the data okay asymmetric key rsa method lot many things and the soft skills what you need like uh, you must use your own judgment you uh, and then how you will going to use your own judgment until unless you will not be well educated you not having the sufficient knowledge uh, along with you then how you will your judgment will not be correct so you need uh, to do a lot of research work yes what are the new methods are coming on the market to secure the data uh, out as per our uh, company budget as per the resources we are having what will be the best for our company okay or you must be able to accept the new challenges uh, uh, how to solve that problem quickly okay and you you need you need to be in a mode always in a critical thinker you you must uh, think like uh, whatever the methods i used whether is uh, if i'm a hacker okay what methods i will use to crack it okay so you need to understand this is the things i'm using these are the algorithm i'm using how much capability to secure the data okay so lot of things need to become cryptographer and definitely when you will start and if you will get 
lot of wonderful information lot of new things and you will start to enjoy yes how to do this one first of all interest is should be there so follow me on the cyber security prism and get the notification for the next interesting and informative session and share that session with your friends and group members as well so that they will be able to understand what is cryptography and how they can become the cryptographer and in the next session i will discuss about should you use or not jailbreak namaste see you in the next session